I'm going to try question six. Um, this ant is walking along one unit and then it's turning right. So it's turning right uh, an angle of 2 pi over 9. I'm immediately going to put that as a minus 2 pi over 9 because it's coming down because it's turning right here. So I'm going to do it again. So another minus 2 pi over 9. And it will then do it once more again, minus 2 pi over 9. Each time it will go along 1. Now, I tried. you could try this with lots of cosine rules. It's really absolutely disgusting. But if we think about this, this rotation here is timesing by an e to the minus 2 pi over 9 i. Then we're going to start getting somewhere. So the first bit's fine. It just goes 1 there to there. But then we need to times that by e to the minus 2 pi over 9 i to say turn there. And then it needs to go another 1. So that's the distance to there. But then we need to rotate it again. So just move that out of the way. So times by another e to the minus 2 pi over 9 and then add 1. And then times by another e to the minus 2 pi over 9, should have an i here, and add 1 on the end. Right, now looking at this bit by bit here. So this bit here was just e to the minus 2 pi i over 9. Now when I add 1 to, to that, I'm now going to times it by all of this. So this is now going to give us e to the 4 pi over 9 i plus, timesing that by 1, e to the minus 2 pi over 9 i, and then add the 1. Beginning to see a pattern here. Now I'm going to times by it again, so I'm going to get e to the minus 6 pi over 9 i, plus e to the minus 4 pi over 9 i, plus 1 times that, e to the minus 2 pi over 9 i, plus the one. I'm going to stop there. Now look, this is just a geometric progression. I'm going to go that way there. So a is one. Each time I'm timesing from there to there is e to the minus two pi over nine i, and n is one, two, three, four. n is four. So the sum formula for the sum to four is um, one minus e to the, this to the power of four, which is 8 pi over 9 i, all over 1 minus just r, which is minus 2 pi over 9 i. So this is what we're looking for. And the trick that we had before was we're going to take out half of them. So e to the minus 4 pi over 9 i, taking those out as a factor, we've got e to the 4 pi over 9 i for the first bit, minus e to the, the other four there. On the bottom, we'll just take out half of those. So that's e to the minus pi over 9. And we've got positive pi over 9i there, because they times together, they get make 1. And another negative minus pi over there. Now, what does that give us? Now, first of all, let's look at these e bits here. So that is minus four ninths minus minus a ninth. So that is e to the minus three pi over nine. So there's our rotational bit. Now, but these two bits here, this is the sine of four pi over nine. We've also got to times that by two i. And this is the sine of pi over 9, also got to times that by 2i. Those things both cancel, and so what have we got? We've got e, e to the minus pi over 3i, so that's, you can see the argument, and the modulus is this bit here in front of it, which, as we hoped for, was the sine of 4 pi over 9, and the sine of pi over 9 on the bottom. There is our modulus.